Yo, camera's gonna be messed up. Yo, hey, actually not that bad. Yo, what's going on, everyone? Actually not that bad. Could be worse. What's going on, boys? How are we this fine Wednesday? Is that what it is, Wednesday? What's going on, Al Hussein? What's going on, Chad? What's going on, Jazeel? Martin Odegaard and his brother, Erling Haaland. What's going on, Tim? Sam Marriage. Have I missed anyone? Teku, what's going on, Teku? It's I Flow. What's going on, Jamie? Good to see you, my guy. Good to see you, indeed. Good to see you, indeed. What is going on, boys? All right, let's continue on. We've been, we've been moving at a snail's pace, haven't we? We've been kind of just this and that, you know? Like, we haven't really been attacking this career mode, have we? Uh, Manchester City will probably jump in at this, at eventually, for this game. Al Hussein slash UNK is back. Good to see you, Al Hussein. I'm so, so, I'm so close to hitting 30 subs. Nice, Chad. Nice. No one cares about first. Do you want a reward? Says Jamie. Wow, Jamie, you sound salty that you didn't get first. That's what it sounds like. So you sound salty. That's all it is. So there's Champions League on, right? <clears throat> what mod manager do you use for FIFA, Guardi? Uh, that's a good question. I don't know what it's called, actually. Um... It's what whichever one the uh, whichever one FIFA or FIFA recommends. Um, I forgot I forgot what it's called. Um, wait, I can't see Jamie in the chat. Why not? Did you find out about the new face mod? No, and also because I ha a FIFA updated, so I think um, mods tend to take a couple days after when... Uh, there's no mods on this career mode anyway. I didn't use mods for this career mode anyway. I've got Vortex for Vegas. What does that mean? Is that what the mod manager is called? Messi doesn't care anymore. I'm just joking. Liverpool got two until get in there, boys. Yeah, this this Karima doesn't actually have mods, but but it, when FIFA updates, then um, the mod manager needs a couple of, or I guess the mod needs a he needs a couple of days to like. My mod manager for Fallout New Vegas is called Vortex. Oh, right, 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 right. No, I don't know what it's called. I think it's just called F FIFA. I, I think it's just called FIFA Mod Manager or something. I don't know. I'll have to look it up. Hold on. It's called Frosty. Sam, it's called Frosty. Frosty Mod Manager. Leishan has completely disappeared now. Actually, no, Leishan was... Leishan Angel was in a stream a couple days ago, actually. Hey, what's going on, Kinners? Oh, hey, Kinners! PXG Pogs, what's going on? How's it going, boys? You gonna make me cry? How come, Teku? Because Barcelona got absolutely spanked, is that why? And here I was on streams, right, saying that Barca was going to win. There's evidence of it. I look like a buffoon for saying that. Barcelona made me look like a right fool. A fool, I tell you. Happy Thursday. Uh, Messi can't carry them this time. Yeah, Messi's, Messi hasn't been able to carry Barcelona in a few years now.
But like realistically, it's such a young team and like it's they're not even that good when you think about it. I stayed PSG after what happened last year. I mean, it's not over, right? Like at the end of the day, it's still technically not over, but it's basically over. Moved to PC, phone was about five seconds behind. Mbappe played really well, uh, but I could score... I could score against this Barca team, says Al Hussein. This Barca team is full on shite. If I'm not typing, I'm in an ultimate team. Hey, Kinners, no need to apologize, my guy. It's all good. It's all good. 2017 Messi is the GOAT, says chat. Mbappe the GOAT of 2021, says Jazeel. You know, it wasn't just that he scored a hat-trick. It's like the quality of goals was also really good. No, speaking of goals. Uh-oh, we haven't given ourselves much time here, huh? Time out, Jazeel, please? Why? We can't time out the manager of Chelsea. What are you talking about? No. Oh, what a ball. Hey, what's going on, Spike Claps? Yo, the... Purple G next to him. Nice. What's going on, Spike Claps? Good to see you. My Nan could single-handedly beat Barcelona. Yeah, like at 1 on 11. Downloading the Frosty Mod Manager. Yeah, that's what I use. Bang. Boom. Here we go. Timo. Oh my goodness. Timo Werner. No, oh, Timo. I wanted it out wide, you banana. No, he was meant to go out wide. You fool. One on the one on the entire Barca squad, yeah. Oh, the whole squad, not not just the starting eleven. That's pretty ballsy. Here we go. No, Taverna, you. F oh, what the hell is with the passing? I just tapped it. Why did he go so heavy on? Hey, what's going on, Ranvia? Barca equals trash, says Jazeel. How is Mbappe overrated? He legit spanked Barca. And then David Liao says Barca deserved that loss. Hey, Sam Harris says giving the stream a like. Exactly, that's what it's all about. If you haven't liked the stream yet, go ahead and do so. I don't really ask for the likes now because it's just like... There's barely anyone watching, so I don't think the likes are going to make that big of a difference. But it could. I don't know, it could. I don't really understand who people who compare players like Salah to Mbappe, who's 22. That's, yeah, that's, I, I agree with you. I hate when people compare, like, uh, what someone's done in their career when they're 30, compared to a player that's, like, 23, 22, I agree. Because if you look at Salah in his early career, no one really thought he'd be anything, right? I mean, like, he'd be a solid player, but he wouldn't be anything like what he is now. Let's give Hudson Odoi a game here. Uh, were you gone for a long time, or did I miss a lo load of streams? I was gone for a long time, Spike Claps. Yeah, Spike, that purple G looks so clean next to your name. So clean. I think by now, I think Joe Hayes might be green by now. Green is the six month one, and that's the longest one. Like, you'll have that for half a year. Well, technically, no, the one year one you'll have for the longest, if you ever get there. But, um. But, um. The green one is like the first really long-term one. Like they're all one month, but then the green one's three months or no, sorry, six months. So PSG did get to the final. Remember when Barca were world class? Now they're non-league level, says PXG Pops. Jesus. I'm happy with my blue one. Well, enjoy them while you can because eventually you'll get moved up. Eventually. It's inevitable. 
Hey, Michael, what's going on, my guy? Good to see you. Holt, damn, what a fogging long time sin of... Are you drunk, Mateo? Remember that it is Barca. Yeah, at the end of the day, it's Barcelona. Capitulators. Mateo, you must be drunk. Maybe? Yeah, okay, he is. I love how everybody calls you Fredbo. Or most people call you Fred. I think he's had too much. Yeah, he's had. He's on the sauce big time, boys. He's, he's over. It's done. Barca are a shadow of their former selves. Yeah. Not the team they used to be. No, I agree with you, Sam. Sad to see what has come about. Yeah, I agree, Michael. It is. Because growing up, like, especially for me, Barca were like, phew, like the team, like... Well run, good academy, great players, like top coach. It, they were always powerhouse, you know what I mean? It just feels like they don't know how to run a club anymore over there. Hey man, can I get a shout out? Sure thing, Yanak Patel, what's going on? F Barca, damn it, says Adomba. What's going on, Adomba? Not a happy man, huh? Man, I'm gonna break my monitor, I swear, says Al Hassan. <laughs> I don't see why people call Messi Pessy. Okay, I'm gonna jump to the result because that's an easy W. After the game, like if he was playing every position, it's so childish to do that. Yeah, because a lot of people don't really care. A lot of people just wanna. You, you, people just want the RTs and the likes. You know what I mean? Like that's what it comes down to. So I might go soon because of my my rival matches. All right, good luck in your rival matches, Spike. Been drinking ever since 4-2 Arsenal beats. <laughs> oh, man. Barca still are the team, I swear. Have I missed something? No. Wolf Doggy, they're not. Uh, hey, why don't you play foot? Uh, it's not really my thing. It's not my cup of tea. I don't enjoy it. F Langley. Wow. I'm going to get myself a Stella Artois. Ooh, that's your beverage of choice, huh? Stella. I'm not really a big fan of Stella Artois, to be honest with you. Still not reading my name correctly? No. Sorry, you'll forever be Wolf Doggy to me. What's up, dude? I haven't seen you in time. Yeah, what's going on, Marcus Rashford? Thanks to the Bartomeu, uh, Barca ha now have Braithwaite, Griezmann, and Pjanic. Hey, man, that's, uh... Stella, the wife, man. Hey, man, um, Braithwaite is a gun. What are you talking about? Stella, the wife, beater. I don't understand that one. Sup, Marcus? So, Spike claps. That's the only alcohol we have left in the house right now. Ah. Uh, who is Marcus. As he so uh, promptly has put it, he used to be called DC United. Wolf Dog Guy. I know it's Wolf Dog Guy, but when he when they first joined the stream, I called them Wolf Doggy. And since then, I've just called it Wolf Doggy. Since then, it's just like a little joke. Um, Stella is major wife beater vibes. Really? I didn't know that, actually. In Australia, that's not... We got a lot worse beers that are like wife beater beers. We got a lot. We do love our beer down here. I was saying hi to Marcus Rashford will be the best left winger in the world. That's true. Stella and a white tank top is a major wife beater. Yes. The classic white tank top, also known as a wife beater. Yes. Uh, Sam Marriage gets it. Salah is the best winger in the world. RN easily, says Al Hussein. Well, I'll let you guys debate that in the, in the, com in the uh, chat. Rashford will never be the best left winger in the world. He has potential, but the dude can't keep himself on side. Who do we think is the best winger in the world right now, guys? Specifically, I guess we could go left wing because the claim is that Marcus Rashford is the best left winger in the world, but... Also, guys, just a show of hands. Like, if I was to play a different game on the channel, 
Would you guys watch? Just a show of hands. Also, I'm gonna aim my K-Way. Like, I don't know what I would play, but if I played, like, Nintendo games or, like, other games... If I played, like, older games and stuff... Like, if I played Pokemon and stuff, like, the old Pokemons and stuff like that, would you guys watch? Ronaldo is a striker now. Yeah, I'd count Ronaldo as a striker. Hey, Mateo, I tried Kiwi with a skin on, and it was much better, no cap. I, I told you guys. I told you guys. Don't take my word for it. Take Mateo's word for it. Luke says depends on the game. Hey, man, I, I appreciate that you're honest. Reese the Beast, what's going on, my guy? Good to see you. I'd still watch them. Okay, some of you just don't care. Some of you would just put, like, whatever I, I upload, you guys will watch. What's going on, um, Ferdy? Good to see you. I love Kiwi, says Chad. Nice. So, Salah is the best winger in the world right now. Are we agreeing on that? Is Salah the best winger in the world? I wouldn't say that. Play F1 games? Actually, that's not a bad idea. I'll tell you why. Because if I live stream it, I could do full length races. Wow, that would be insane. Sorry, what? Chad, you have kiwis in your salad? What? Are you serious? <clears throat> Love a good whiskey? Hey, Sam Marriage, me too. I was actually drinking whiskey last night while watching the Australian Open. Are any of you guys into tennis? There's a good question. I don't think we've talked about that before. Are any of you guys into tennis? I tried drunk racing the other day and it went horribly. Drunk racing. I assume you mean on F1. On the game. Hopefully not in real life. Gotti tried it so good. I prefer Brandy. I really... Out of all things I can, like, drink, I prefer Cognac. I find that smoother than whiskeys. But it's expensive, so... What's up, Gardy? How was yesterday? What's going on, Bogdan? Uh, I, w I didn't stream yesterday, actually, because I was watching the Australian Open, and it went on to, like, 1am here. The uh, Djokovic versus um, Zverev match? It went until freaking 1am. I didn't want to get up after that. I lost to my sister in chess, so I gotta go K KMS now. Hey, is your, is your sister any good at it? Are you any good at it, Hyper JJ? I don't know which of these I want to do. What the hell? He's only got pace and physical. He doesn't even have defending stats. Can I get his defending stats up? Spike Clap says, Guardi, I might be getting a PC soon. Nice. Uh, like, a really good one or what? Like, how much are you willing to invest in that? If That's if you're paying for it. I don't know, even know if you're paying for it. Man, I need Brent here. Brent is always like, do this, do that. I feel like, I feel lost without Brent. Uh, Diane is in the chat, but they've, she's gotten rid of her message, unfortunately. I love that Sam Marriage is the only uh, other person with a dog picture. Is Jazil gone, maybe? Gardy, did you see PK and Griezmann fighting? Yeah, what was that all about? I, I've been to a couple uh, tournaments and she's four grades ahead of me. Oh, she, she doesn't have like an ELO rating or something? Like, do you play online? Like, what rating are you online? Jazil, if we are saying that for Sterling, then I would say Salah, he's still scoring. Long time no see. What's going on, Diane? Teku Barca is trash. Wow. 
Holy fuck, I have to cut my hair soon, says Mateo. Hey, man. Just grow it out. Like me. Get the guardy hairstyle. Uh, Wolf Doggy, uh, that my that my little guy, Charlie, he's a 14-year-old doggo. 14! Whoa. That's a decent innings for a, a dog. No? Not to, like, talk about his potential age, like, an incoming... Uh, okay, let's just stop talking about it. But yeah, that's pretty old for a dog, I think. I've never actually had a dog, so I don't actually know for sure. I have around 450 pounds to spend on a PC. Could you help? I am the worst person to talk about PC. I, I didn't build my own PC. My cousin did it for me. I know very little about PCs. I only know that I've got... Uh, actually, I've forgotten the name of my graphics card. I got the um, NVIDIA... Oh, come on. I clicked out before the game started. NVIDIA... I got the 3070, I think. So I got a pretty new graphics card. But the rest of my PC, I couldn't even tell you. Um, Hakuna Matata, see the chat's going on. Hakuna Matata, good to see you again. I didn't think you'd be back, but good to see you again. He's an old dog, behaves like a puppy. That's so cute. I dyed my hair and I hate it, and it's permanent uh, hair dye. Oh my gosh, what color is it? Teku, calm down, mate. What's going on, Teku? Welcome back. Did you get over it? Ever since Greenman said he was the same level as Messi and Ronaldo, he's been crap, no cap. Yeah. I mean, he should have never left Atletico Madrid at that point. Um, my ex-friend is into James Charles, by the way. That's the reason I put X before friend. <laughs> oh, Mateo, I like that. <laughs> When he was bullying me, you did nothing. Now you want to effing calm down? No, says Teku. What's going on, Teku? I don't understand. We were shitting on Barcelona. It's part of football, mate. Banter. Hey, what's going on, Joad? Good to see you, my man. We aren't going to lie and say James Charles is kind of bad. No, James Charles is very bad. Whoa, have we got a fight in the chat? Mateo, if a boy likes James Charles, I'm not going anywhere in a six foot radius of them, says Jazil. Barca go... Barca got themselves into this mess. Michael makes a good point. It is Barcelona's fault that they're this bad. Hey, Flickify's in the chat says, Tacos for lunch and Gardi stream. Woo! Flickify doing his uh, usual ritual where he's eating always in the chat. He's always taking a break from editing or working or something and eating while in the chat. Tacos. Damn. I gotta ask. Hard shell, soft shell. What are we talking here? Remember Braithwaite is a Barca player? Who's fighting? Uh, Wolf Doggy, we're gonna do... We're building up a pay-per-view for like a boxing pay-per-view. Main event is Teku versus Jazil. For the pride of Barcelona. Uh, I'm gonna join you then, Jazil. Six foot radius. Uh, what kind of tacos flick, says HyperJJ. Exactly, yeah. You, uh, you know the saying, you win some, you lose some. For Barca, you win none, lose all. <laughs> I'm personally a Lengua Tacos guy. What's Lengua? Guardi, have you seen Chelsea vs Barca 2009? The most rigged match Barca bought the referee. I do remember that match, Ash, yes. Flick never sees my comments, says Jazeel. I'm sure he does see them. Soft shell is better. Yeah, I, I probably agree with you on that. That's not bullying, that's just banter, and plus Chelsea will do bad again, they have Atletico Madrid. That's true, actually, that's true, Teku. Just wait until Atletico Madrid play Chelsea, because you'll be able to banter Jazil right back. Wolf Doggy, I'm not uh, a big fan, but I think he's not very manly, says Sam Marriage. <laughs> when are tickets on sale for the fight? Uh, I still have to figure that part out. Oh, Ruben. Come on, I guess your former team. That is just a standard American hard shell beef taco. Ooh. Hard shell. Look, I don't actually, I don't mind hard shell, but there's something about that soft shell that just gets me. I don't know what it is. But I agree with the ads, like, uh, ¿Por qué no los dos? I actually just agree with that, like, just have a bit of both, you know what I mean? Have one hard, one soft, you know what I mean? Anyway, no one answered my question. Does anybody watch tennis? No, literally, I don't think a single person answered my question. Anybody watch tennis? Ah! 
Referee! Oh, you're having a laugh, ref. That was a fail. Hold on. Mount! Oh! Ah. Oh. I love James Charles, though. Uh, you are just jealous of him, says Wolf Doggy. I sure do love me some cow tongue tacos. Ooh. Uh, just when Atleti destroyed you, I prefer burritos. I watch it once a year. Is that when there's like uh, uh, an open that's local to you? No, it's boring. Oh my gosh. I played. You play tennis, Mateo? Nice, dude. I never, like, I never knew in other, like, especially in Europe. I don't know if it's, because there's a lot of players that come out of Europe, right? So I never knew, is it popular there? Like, which countries is it popular in? Like, is it popular in Spain? France? You know what I mean? Like, I always wondered, like, Serbia. Like, like I know the, the Baltic countries have, like, a lot of players come from there. Russia has a lot of players. Like, where is it popular to actually watch tennis? Like, who the hell is staying up to watch the Australian Open? That's what I want to know. I'd fall asleep during tennis. It's that boring. No, it's really what? It's really entertaining, guys. It's really fun. Boys, next time the French or the Wimbledon is or Wimbledon is uh, on, you should watch it. That's more like it's more local time for you guys. You should give it a go. If you haven't tried it, you should give it a go. It's fun. Come on, Woot. Woot. Oh no, he was like two steps away. <laughs> Uh, your top striker is Braithwaite. Are we still talking about Barcelona? Mate, uh, the only tennis player I know is Serena Williams. Oh, Hyper JJ, come on. You're American and you don't know about tennis? You've never heard of Andy Roddick? Jim Courier? Oh my god. John McEnroe? You've never heard of these absolute lit- They don't play now, all three of those. You've never heard of the legends of the game? America's produced some of the best players. And you produce so many of them. Right now, you've got a, a player on tour. His name is Riley Opelka. He's a pretty young guy, and he's six foot eleven, and he plays tennis. My theory is that he wasn't good enough to play basketball. And also, you got some Americans doing well in the Oz Open in the females. Pagulia and uh, Brady. I think they both did really well. I think they played each other actually. To go through to a, maybe a semi-final. I think they're in the semi-finals now. Go. Go, Cesar. El Capitano. Go. No. I can't believe I'm going to lose to Fulham at home. What the hell? Andy Murray. Andy Murray was a hell of a tennis player. A bit of a cock, but a hell of a tennis player. I can't believe this. At home to Fulham. Increíble. Unbelievable. What's going on? Ruben, again. Oh, wow. Damn, man. They just shat on me. I don't understand how you, as a James Charles fan, are watching the Gardy streams. It's their marriage. Uh, any, I mean, you can watch anybody you want. Atletico versus Chelsea will be playing in my country. I'm so upset that I can't see it in stadium. Gardy, how do you know all this stuff? I'm a huge tennis fan. I guarantee you almost no person I know watches tennis in the US. Yeah, I mean, you guys have so many more sports that you can watch, right? Uh, Barca stand a chance, unlike Chelsea. Gardy, if that tennis player uh, that is 6'11 could uh, be the backboard and basketball hoop. Nah, 6'11 really isn't uh, that. Are you really losing against Fulham on Legendary? Yeah, I am. 6'11 is, uh, in basketball terms, is not that... I mean, it's tall, but it's not super duper, like, out of this world tall. But in tennis, he's literally the tallest player that's ever played tennis. Uh, tied with uh, Ivo Kovacic. Whatever the hell his name is. And there was another American, uh, John Isner, who was 208 centimeters, which is like 6'10". Man, you Americans produce some tall boys. Uh, the reason I know all these players is because um, I watch tennis. I'm, like, really into tennis. I can't believe I just literally got shat on by Fulham. Not gonna lie. Like, they literally just squatted and took a huge steaming, like, dump on my face. How tall are you? I'm 6'3". 
I'm more, I'm close, I think I'm closer to 6'3 than 6'2, but I'm in between. I just say I'm 6'3 because it sounds better. Uh, fun fact, the only person who knows the ending of One Piece besides the author was a Make-A-Wish kid who asked for the ending before he died. Yo, no cap, if I was gonna die, I would also try and learn the ending of One Piece, because holy... I recently started watching it again. Uh, also, of course Hyper JJ brings it back to anime, but like, let's... I've recently started watching it again. Man, Dress Rosa is such a long damn arc. It's so long. Marco 66. I wish I was 66 Marco. I wish. At least 64. I wish I was at least 64. Uh see you later Chad. Thanks for dropping by man. Hey, 20 people watching. That's pretty good. That's not bad. The streams have been a bit quiet since I've returned, but this is good. And you know what I like the most? Today the chat has been very active. We've been talking a lot. J uh, Gardy, do you like James Charles? Absolutely not. No. I the opposite of like him. I dislike him. What is going on? I mean, I... I can accept that it's the goat. So. Um. Teku, whatever dude, we will see, says Jazeel. At least we never lost 8-2. Wow. Well. Gadi, what do you think about the young American Osaka? Well, she represents Japan, but yeah, she is American. I think she's good. I think she's good. Um, so with the women's side of tennis, obviously the men's side's been dominated by Novak, Federer, and Nadal. But the women's has been pretty open. Like other than Serena Williams, you don't have too many players that have won like multiple Grand Slams. Um, but I think Osaka could be a bit more like Serena. Like I feel like she's just a cut above the rest of the the field right now. So she might actually, she won't win as many as Serena, I don't think. That would be ridiculous. But you could see her winning two or two to three Grand Slams a year, I think. It, would be, it wouldn't be unrealistic. To see her winning at least two a year would not be unrealistic in my opinion. Remember Sharapova? Yeah. How the hell could I forget about Sharapova? How do you even explain Maria Sharapova? Like, growing up as a boy, I was like, what is- Who is this? Who is this goddess? Grunting like a fucking animal while playing tennis. Jazeel versus Teku has been getting better and better. Yeah, this is all promotion for the boxing event. Teku versus, um, Jazeel is the main event. And we got some, like, smaller ones that we'll- We'll do Leishan Angel versus Jamie. As, like, a co-main event. <laughs> what other matches should we have? What other matches should we have, guys? I'm taking this penalty. I don't care what Timo... I, I don't trust Timo. Look at this placement. Look at this. Oh, look at this beauty. Oh, yes! <laughs> Alright, let's get back into the sim. Beautiful stuff. She's always screaming like an idiot. It's true. His story has ended up like her mother having a child she didn't want because she had to. Yo, Attack on Titan, the next episode better be good because the last two episodes have been like nothing has happened. How many episodes are in this season, uh, Hyper JJ? Like, it's the last season, yeah? How many more episodes is there? Lost to Roma, then Liverpool, then Bayern, then Juventus, now PSG, boy, STFU. Wow, it's getting heated. It's getting heated right now. We've learned to not waste money on uh, Verna and Havertz. Nah, me and Addy are fine, says HyperJJ. Nice. I would fight Sam Marriage again. We could do Sam Marriage versus Wolf Doggy undercard. Yeah, we could do that. That looks like a good one. Hey, Light Helix, what's going on? Good to see you again. Barca wasting money on Griezmann? I think 12 Guardi and there will be a part two. Wait, what do you mean? Just like last season. Wait, what? What do you mean? Like they're splitting the season up? Seventeen likes on the stream, not bad. Yeah, considering that, like, um, the numbers have been way, way lower since I took the break.
Bogdan says, like I said, how did we turn um, from this beautiful stream into a Barca trash defense without Araujo? Uh, they actually did some good stuff, you know, says Teku. Last AOT season had two parts, so I think they're going to do it again. I don't remember that. I don't remember it was split into two parts. I don't remember that. So it's going to be it's going to be one long season split into two seasons, right? It's split, split into two parts. Like that's like a break halfway, right? Is that what you mean? Is that how it was last season? I don't remember. My memory is bum. Um Teku Lamia, what has Dembele, Paulinho and Braithwaite done? Not one shit. They haven't taken a single shit, really. You cannot say Griezmann is a good signing because he's done nothing for 100 million. One one against West Ham. Man, we are struggling to get some points on the board. Gadi, you know what is funnier than twenty four? Tell me, Reese the Beast. Ali, what's going on? <clears throat> Hello, I'm back. What's going on, Ali El Shafi? Good to see you. I don't know. I just started watching AOT in March. Says Hyper JJ. Wait, what? You weren't watching AOT until last March. I've been watching it since like season two. Twenty five is funnier than twenty four. I don't get it. <clears throat> I really don't get that. What is funnier than twenty four? Twenty five. I don't get that. Can you explain that one to me? At least we've dominated in Champions League. We've gone. We've won every Champions League game. That's pretty good. Maybe we can rest up a little bit. Of course, resting up with this squad means nothing because we don't even have any players. So. Resting up in this squad literally means nothing. Let's give Anjorin a run. And uh, McEachran. And Somerville. Let's give them all a taste of Champions League football. We'll, we'll put Hudson Odoi and Weghorst as well. Negative three and negative four versus negative three and negative four. Same thing. Okay. Uh, and Mendy can play goalkeeper. Poor Wee Caballero. He doesn't get games. Poor guy. <coughs> I watched AOT late because Netflix doesn't have full seasons. Oh, wow. I watch on Crunchyroll. I'm back again. Me, my sister, and brother all have an account. Uh, Dembele has more fines than Barca goals. Is that true? Did you hear PK screaming at his teammate yesterday? Yeah, Marco. I, I did say that, actually. Uh, it was Griezmann, I believe. What's going on, Josh Grove, by the way? Good to see you. It's from SpongeBob? Sorry, Reese. I'm not too familiar with SpongeBob. I watched it growing up, but I can't quote it like that. Like, I don't, I don't know word-for-word -word quotes. Dortmund winning 3-1. You know what's absolutely ridiculous? Dortmund were paying $3 to win this. <laughs> so for every dollar you put on them, I don't know how your, your guys' betting odds work, but in Australia, we just... For every dollar you put on, they tell you how many you win. They're paying 3 bucks, And uh, that's insane value, I'd say. I can't believe Porto's winning, though. That's a bit surprising. Do you do donations? Uh, Josh Grow, there's super chats, yeah. There is super chats. That's the only form of donation I got at the moment. Uh, just because I haven't really bothered to set up a PayPal and stuff. Hold on. I got to talk to my mate. Because my mate was talking to me about the Sevilla Dortmund game. And he's like, what do you think about the odds? And I was like, Dortmund at three bucks is ridiculous. Ireland got two goals. He was screaming at Griezmann and Dest because they couldn't even have possession for five seconds. I have a Crunchyroll premium account now. Well, there you go. Woot! Woots with a goal. Wait, who was that? Jaden says, finally got the notification. Wow, Jaden, it took you that long. 
to get a notification that's ridiculous i just jumped into the quintessentials quintuplets hype since i don't want to be late for the hype like i know wait what <laughs> quint quintessential quintuplets hype since i don't want to be late for the hype like how i was late for the rent a gf what is quintessential quintuplets I, I, what the hell is that? City is up with Everton. Teku, how old is your club? Says Jazil. <laughs> FFS, they're older than us. <laughs> Jazil, that one backfired, huh? I've never heard of quintessential quintuplets. No. What is that? It's an anime that's popular right now. Really? Is it about quintuplets? Winter essential the quintessential quintuplets oh I, oh my god okay i see released march 20 wait what released march 25 2021 it's not even out yet oh i see i see it's it's been out this is uh this is a new volume oh it started from august 2017 Honestly, I, I find it hyper JJ, I find it really difficult to get into an anime if it's not based around combat. I don't know why. It's like Or at the minimum it has to be like a... it doesn't have to necessarily be, be be combat, but Gotta read my last comment. Alright. Just for you. Hazard almost weighs more than Real Madrid bought him for. Wow. He nearly weighs more than 100 million pounds. Oh, actually, how much did he cost? How much was Hazard's fee? Wow, you shonen nerd. I really am a shonen nerd, yeah. If I want to, like... I don't know. I don't know. I'm not watching animes to watch freaking... High school dramas, you know what I mean? How you doing, Gardy? I'm good, Sam. Wait, Sam. Why are you on that account? I'm doing well though. How are you? Alright, 1 0. We'll take that win. Mate, six of six wins, boys. In the Champions League group stages. We went a perfect six of six. How often does that happen? That's a pretty rare thing, right? To go six of six. That doesn't happen every day, does it? The arc when they get to the super... Um, the, wait. <laughs> the arc when they went to the supermarket was super fire. That's the main insult shown in main say to romance watchers. I, I don't care what you watch. I'm just saying like what I like to watch. Why am I... Why am I what account? People say Chelsea spend oil money. If you add up all our sales, we made over 250 million and we spent 175. Of that is just smart investment, unlike Barca's board, says Jazil. No, it's oil money. Hey, official DTT Chrome is back. What's going on? We were taken over by Madriditas. Madriditas. Hey, guys, what's going on, Brian? It's good to see you, my guy. Marco Royce or Mesut Ozil? Hmm. During their absolute peaks, I would take Mesut Ozil. Guardi, which is more oil money, Chelsea, City, or PSG? I would have to say it's between City and PSG. But Chelsea is oil money too. I'd, I'd probably go City. You jealous the Glazers just don't care? Yes, I am. I'm very jealous that the Glazers don't care. Guardi, on my Bolton RTG, I found a kid in the youth system and his potential was 86 to 92. That's absolutely incredible. That's absolutely incredible. I want to know everything about PSG were nothing before the takeover. Now look, uh, same with City. 
First time here, what's going on? Says Yellow Salamander. We are doing a Chelsea career mode. Currently losing to uh, Crystal Palace of all teams, 1-0 at Stamford Bridge. Um, what is going on? We're talking about uh, Chelsea and Barca. Because we got a Chelsea fan saying that Barca's crap and a Barca fan saying Chelsea's crap. So that's basically what it is. That's what that's the current conversation, but we've talked about a lot of different things so far. Langley is a damn clown, says Brian Tess. Woo! A clown. How is Chelsea oil money? Uh, we legit made it from selling uh, the youth players Morata and Hazard. Uh, Jazeel, you should look up the history of your own club because... Just look it up. That's all I'll say. Uh, remember when City lost 8-1 to Middlesbrough? I actually don't remember that. Mbappe shuts the whole Barca fan, <laughs> says Gaming with us. Guardi, you know what is funny? Real paid 100 mil and scored two goals, and Barca paid 30 mil and Trin Tricao, or whatever the hell his name is, scored three goals. I am over PSG will win the Champions League? I don't think so. He's been calling us trash for the past hour. Never been on a FIFA live stream, says uh, Yellow Salamander, and he says, love the energy. Woo! There you go. All right, let's go, boys. 1-1 one, one at half time. Come on, boys. We're not going to lose to Crystal Palace the same way did, we did against Fulham, surely. Uh, HyperJojo says it's a bit weird how my local football team is LA Galaxy and LAFC. Which one do you prefer? Or you don't really care. I, actually, you know what? HyperJojo doesn't even like football. Like, he's just here for the anime talk. He's here for the anime content. I think the Youth Wonder Kid will be a mad rating of 91. I reckon he'll be even higher than that, DTT Chrome. I didn't know I was uh, subscribed to you. Do you remember the last time you watched a video from me, Yellow Salamander, or no? PK, Langley, and Busquets shouldn't start in the second game versus PSG. If PSG win, at least we got eliminated by the champions and not Atleti. I can't lie to you, Guardi. I am already on the stream with uh, other accounts. Oh, okay. Who do you think? Who do we think Yellow Salamander is? Oh, Yellow Salamander and Wolf Doggy is Sam Marriage. Is that what I'm picking up here? <clears throat> no way, Sam Marriage. You've been Wolf Doggy the whole time? What the hell, man? I didn't know that. You got me good. The only football player I've been to, the only football I've been to was an LA Galaxy game where Steven Gerrard scored a hat trick. Wow, that's why I started supporting Liverpool, says Hyper JJ. That's disgusting. That is disgusting. So, are you, Sam Marriage, are you also Salamander? Are you also a yellow Salamander? Love, to say, love the way you say wolf doggy, cracks, cracks me up. I really, like, no joke, but when I first read it out, that's what I thought it was. Obviously, now I know, but, like, when I first read it out, I legit thought it was Wolf Doggy. Our lineup should have been to Stegen, Alba, Mingueza, Araujo, Dest, De Jong, Pedri, Messi, Trincao, Dembele, and Griezmann. So, PK is a big liability, is that what you're saying, Bryant? Is PK a liability now? I was actually enjoying uh, battling Jazil, says Teku. Hey, legendary crew just saw you now in the uh, in the chat. What's going on, dude? If you're still here, PK is a wow. Okay. So PK is washed. PK is done. Essentially, is what you're saying. Look at this freaking December we've got. Liverpool twice, United away, Wolves away. Not easy. PK and Griezmann were fighting in the middle of the match. Yeah, I know. I don't know what that was about. Someone said that he wasn't happy that Griezmann and Dest couldn't hold possession, I think. I think that's what someone said. Uh, 
Uh, Barca are not trash, but Teku, you can't expect to ban to me and Jamie about Liverpool and Chelsea and not expect it back. Didn't you start this, Jazeel? Uh, I joined the Discord and my name, my Discord name was Yellow Salamander, so I felt I should revive my old YouTube account with the same name. Ah, Sam, what a story. Um, Titi, haven't heard that name in a while. Yeah, me neither. I ain't saying nothing about Liverpool, says Teku. Why not? They're shit. Uh, we need to go all out to pass PSG, says Bryant. Do you guys... Uh, Bryant, do you think that you guys will play like a different formation to try and get at them or no? You reckon that the manager will just do the same thing again and again? What's his name? Freaking uh, Ronald. Ronald McDonald. Trent Alexander... Uh, uh, Trent Alexander Arnold. Um... Or Andy Robertson. I'm definitely buying. Demon Slayer is coming out with a game. Jamie got mad at the both of us. Well, wow. uh, you effing started it. You just uh, cry that I bantered when you started. That's true. Actually, Jazil started it. Knowing Kuman, he will just start the same lineup rather than trying new uh, something new, which pisses me off. If Barsov is out uh, of Champions League, Kuman is out. Unbelievable stuff. I'm not a flower. I won't cry for that. I go up with everyone. Then you start bullying me. Hey, Sam Marriage, upgraded membership to player. Woo, he's not a water boy anymore, guys. He's a player. Official. Sign the contract and everything. Get some love for Sam Marriage, please. Also known as Sam Marriage, Wolf Doggy, and Yellow Salamander. Let's get him some love. Yo, Sam, if we ever play, um... If we ever play pro clubs and stuff, you can play. Official. Comunicado Oficial. Sam Marriage has signed an upgraded contract as a player with Guardi FC. What position do you play, Sam? Fullback, wow. Pro clubs is so fun. Yeah, I can't wait to play some pro clubs with you guys. But I need a console first, because playing pro clubs on PC is impossible. Can I play in your pro clubs? I, I'm actually quite good. I mean, when I'm playing with subs, like I'll play with basically everyone. But priority is, goes to like members. As you could imagine. The priority is with the members. I don't have money. No, no, no. It's all right. You don't have to. Have... <laughs> you don't have to become a member, Josh. I'll probably still play with like normal subscribers, but I'm just saying the priority goes to members. That's all I'm saying. Brian, there's no way that is uh, that this 2020 Barca is getting past PSG. Mateo says, how about shutting up and realizing that Arsenal is the best club in the world? Okay, Jazeel and Teku. Instead of fighting each other, why don't you work together to banter Arsenal against Mateo? Because that's an easy target. That's an easy target. Oh, 
Oh, penalties. Okay. All right, I'm, I'm jumping in for the penalties. Let's go. Our tactic will work. No, Ward Prowse took it without me. Oh, oh, he scored. I thought he put it wide. Oh, he scored. Okay. The old, the tactic of going right every single time, boys. That didn't go in? You go right every single time, boys. No, Allison. No. Ah, oh, genie. What a penalty. All right, let's go, Havertz. Beautiful. All right. Firmino is going right. Saved! What a save. Oh, that went back in! Did you see that? Can I do instant replay? Liverpool have been absolutely robbed. No, it's... it's... I can't... Can I show it to you guys? No, it's not going to let me show. <laughs> it's not going to let me show. Look, it's going back in. Oh, that's be they've been robbed. They've been robbed, boys. I can't even lie. Liverpool have been robbed. Go watch it back on the stream. It was going in. Oh, what a save. What is Allison doing? How is he pulling out these saves? What a save, Yana Black. Oh, my word. Oh, so this is to win it. Cesar, el capitano. To win the match. Cesar, go! Porto 2 0 up against Juve. Wow. Bro, Juve is losing. I know, 2 0. What the hell? I'm still calling it. Liverpool got rubbed for that one. You're going to watch Porto versus Juve? Go for it, Bryant. Enjoy. They got Varane at Liverpool. Wow. Yeah. They've only had 39% possession and three shots on target, but they've scored two goals. Unbelievable stuff. Porto. Also, this is really weird. Premier League on during Champions League is really, really weird. Like, has this ever happened? Or that, like, this doesn't happen, surely. And they've never scheduled Premier League on Champions League nights. <laughs> Isn't that really weird? Barcelona have been um, uh, successfully for a long time. Being bad is... Wait, 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 wait. Barcelona have been successful for a long time. Being bad is only now to Teku. Uh, Gardi, what do you think... Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Gardi, what do you think? London is red, white, or blue? Manchester is red or blue? Madrid is red or white? Your opinions. Uh, London is red. You're not... Uh, Manchester is red. And Madrid is white. That's what I think. They're doing it because Corona? Oh, wow. Uh, is the Guardi FC career mode likely to still happen, or have you changed your mind? No, that'll probably still happen, Sam. That'll probably still happen. Later in the FIFA cycle, that'll probably happen. Hey, Mooka, it's G. What's going on? I think your name is Marco, isn't it? What's going on, Marco? Oh, my back is so itchy. I don't know why. I'm not sure why. It's annoying me. It's in a weird spot as well. <clears throat> Jazeel, I knew I'd get you with that. <laughs> Jazeel, you bit. You bit on it. <laughs> oh, bloody hell, Jazeel. Catalonia is red, blue, or blue, white? I mean, it's obviously Barcelona, right? <laughs> Jazeel. He bit. He bit like a desperate fish. Uh, sorry, who's four in the league, says Josh Groh. 
Uh, Catalonia is, uh, oh, sorry, out of it. How much would uh, I have to donate to steal the captain's armband? Oh my goodness. I haven't even thought about a captain yet. London is red, mate. Yeah, I think it is too. What's going on, Chani Sports, also known as Diamond Boy? What's going on, my man? Everton are the biggest team in Liverpool. Yeah, I'd have to agree with that. I'd say Everton are the biggest team in Liverpool, yeah. Espanol is better than us. Yeah, but when I say like London, when I say London is red, I don't mean like Arsenal is the best team in London right now. I just mean they're the most well-known and maybe prestigious team. I don't know what the right way to put it is. I don't know what the right way to put it is. Yo, Ryan. <laughs> Oh, dude, what's, go what's going on, dude? He says, hello there. It's the return of the Ryan. How's McDonald's treating you, Ryan? Are we good? Long shifts or what? What's going on? Liverpool is sixth. If London is red, we're probably still in the 90s. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not saying it as if, like, Arsenal are the best team right now, but I just think that when I say it, it just means, like, when I think of London, like, when I think of the biggest London club, I think of Arsenal. It doesn't mean they're the best. Biggest doesn't mean best. That's the way I, I think of it. Like, that's the way I interpret it. Ryan loves a super chat. It's true. If London is red, then Spurs have won the treble. They have. Audi Cup. Um, Tesco Cup. I don't know. I'm making other things up. I don't know. They've won the treble of being the biggest banter club in the league. The worst team in the league. London is actually brown because of West Ham. So, but it's not brown. It's claret, isn't it? Isn't that what they call it? Claret? Claret or claren or whatever the hell it is. It's maroon, basically. Hammers. Oh. Spurs have won the Guardi Cup. They wish they could win the Guardi Cup. Yo, Ryan again. Five euro fifty. Says I haven't worked in a month because of COVID nineteen. Stay safe, boys. Ah, oh, what? Ah, oh, finally it goes. Finally the alert. Like two seconds later. Yo, Ryan. Um, I thought you were working during COVID, like last year. No. Why now? They've why now they've taken. Also, why are you giving me your money if you if you're not even working at Macca's anymore? Why, why are you donating if you don't even have the Macca's money to donate? Unbelievable. The commitment. Unbelievable stuff, Ryan. It has to be said. Also, I haven't seen you since, like, uh, Christmas and stuff. So, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, I guess. Because I remember you telling me that when uh, when it was New Year, you'd give me... You'd donate. That's what you said. And I haven't seen you since because I stopped streaming. So, sorry about that. Uh, hold on, Spurs won the three years trophyless treble. Three years trophyless treble. The only thing I was right about is our youth. Juve looking real shaky at the moment. It's not brown. It's more like purple than brown. I think yeah, it's like a mixture of like red and purple. No, isn't that what maroon and like claret is? It's a mixture of red and purple. I could be wrong. Uh, Ramos or Van Dyke? We've had this conversation before. And uh, the answer is Ramos. Dutton, I got it, <laughs> nah, I got it, bud. Hey, thanks so much, Ryan. I appreciate it, dude. I appreciate that. 
Sam Marriage says, Ryan, do you not know about memberships? I've all, I every single time Ryan donates, I always tell him about memberships. And he just doesn't care. It's like he doesn't even talk. Not he only talks through super chats, exclusively through super chats. It's unbelievable. I actually, like, I genuinely don't believe he works at McDonald's. I just can't believe that. Like, if McDonald's pay enough, if McDonald's pay that much, maybe I should go work there. If they're paying enough for me to super chat people, I should go work there. True. Hopefully you get your, hopefully you get some shifts back, uh, Ryan. I, I don't know. I don't know where you're from. I think you're from Ireland, but I hope it's uh, getting better in Ireland. And if it's if you're not from Ireland, I hope it's getting better wherever you're from. Get a membership and you get a big chat. Exactly. Yeah. Guardy chat. GGG. Yeah. Ryan is committed. He's committed to the game. Yeah. But he could become a member. Uh, I don't know why he doesn't, but he doesn't. He does things his own way. I like that about Ryan. He 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 goes to the beat of his own drum. He doesn't really care what other people tell him to do. He will do what he wants to do. And I respect that. I respect that. Damn, Gotti, you ruined Alexis Sanchez. He ruined himself. That bum. He ruined himself. Ever since he sat down to play that piano. What's going on, Arman? Good to see you again. He says, hi, how are you? I'm doing well. How are you? He was such a class player. He was a bum. He couldn't handle it mentally. He couldn't handle it. He couldn't handle the step up from a small club like Arsenal to a big club like Manchester United. He couldn't handle the step up. That's what it was. And I don't blame him. Playing for Arsenal is easy. Expectations are low. Do you know what I mean? Small club mentality. That doesn't matter if you play well or play badly. It doesn't matter if you win or lose. Then you make that step up to a premier club, a pr an absolute upper echelon club, yeah? And he couldn't handle it. Say that to Maguire? Yeah, same with him, that bum. Anyone could play well for Leicester. I could play well for Leicester. We were actually good back then, though. I know, I'm taking the piss. Um, I could play for Leicester. I, I, no joke, I could have played for Leicester's Premier League winning side. No joke. I'm better than Wes Morgan and freaking Robert Huth. Straight up. Robert Huth was like 36 and he was the starting centre back. Whatever the hell his name was. Wes Morgan, to be fair, he was good. To be fair. Um, but yeah, I could play for Leicester. So Maguire is nothing special. Uh, Sanchez has said... Coming at Inter is like coming to football. That's because he's an idiot. Uh, 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 what do you think about York? You mean Dwight York? Oh, like I don't understand all the all the. I don't understand the question. I'm sorry to say, I don't understand the question. Goal, Timo Werner. Uh, uh, like, what do I think about him as a footballer? He was good. What do I want to see in FIFA 22? Says Emmett Quinn. Um, a competent, a competent uh, game being created. A game that makes somewhat sense. A career mode that makes sense. A career mode that has had some time invested into it. Uh, but yeah, going back to the York thing. Um, I thought he was good, yeah. I mean, I, I don't really remember Dwight York's career, especially... especially um, at Manchester United, I don't really remember it. When he moved to... I, even at Black... I don't remember him that much at Blackburn. But I remember him at Birmingham City, strangely enough. And obviously, he went to Sydney FC for a year. 
And then I remember his few years at Sunderland. But I don't actually remember him at Manchester United that much. I thought he was pretty good. Um, Muka G says Stones or Maguire. You know, some I'd still take Maguire. I don't know why. I still would. Sanchez knows his career is over. Yeah, he has to go to the Italian League to play slow-paced bum football. Nah, Italian League's fine. I don't mind Italian League. Sanchez is a bum, though. How's our Indians performs against your Aussies in cricket, says Gaming with Ash. Well, you guys are playing uh, England now, aren't you? I wasn't lucky enough to see the best uh, player in our history. I heard him and Cole was a deadly duo. Well, that's the thing about them. Like, they worked much better together than on their own. Um, but I, I don't, I actually don't remember the early 2000s for football. I mean, I was old enough to, to have remembered it, but I, for some reason, don't remember it that well. I have, like, little flashes here and there. I start really remembering football in, like, 2006. That's when I start really remembering. Uh, Italian league is tough. AC Milan, Inter Milan, Juve, Lazio, Napoli, Roma. And actually, this year actually is very competitive, yeah. Europa League 2 is coming and West Ham will be in it. I hate that idea. I still don't like that idea. No cap. Feel as toe this is a super chat kind of day jumping on Ryan's vibes but for this much I need to milk this for the bot. We love Gardy. Sam Marriage. <laughs> Thanks Sam. <laughs> I appreciate that dude. <laughs> but for this much I need to milk this for the bot. <laughs> oh, I love that. Hey thanks so much Sam. Can we get some love for Sam? Already a member of the channel and donating five pounds. Absolutely unbelievable. Thanks so much, Sam. I don't know what, what's going on today. The donations, huh? I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I wanted to, hear my, uh, wanted to hear it say my name. That's fair. That's fair. I agree with you, Sam. If you're going to donate, you may as well milk it. You may as well get as much as you can out of it. Mukert G is uh, difficult for you to pronounce. Is it not pronounced like Mukert G? Is it like uh, some? Is it like some of it silent? Like is it Muk Mukert G? Is like is the J silent? Like how do you actually pronounce it? Messi or Ronaldo? For me, Messi is the goat. Uh, for me, Messi slightly edges Ronaldo as well. Yeah, but their careers are still going technically. Italian league is much stronger defensively than any other team. The whole league is defensively stronger than any other team. I guess the whole league would be... Yeah. The whole league would be stronger. If you get like a, 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 a Serie A All-Stars, then yes, they would be... Yeah. <clears throat> Wanted to hear it say my name? Nah, I'm getting too much, says Sam Marriage. I put 49 out of 50 characters. You did... Yeah, you got your money's worth. That's for sure. Europa League 2 next year, but how will EA add it in? Or just They're just going to add it in, aren't they? Maybe that maybe that means they'll actually take a look at career mode. Or or on the flip side, it could mean that because they're so busy doing Europa League 2, they don't do anything else with career mode because they'll be like, "Ah, oh, look, we added Europa League 2." You had Henri and Burkamp, you heard they were a deadly duo too. They were. Henri and Bergkamp was very deadly. Both very, very talented. Henri was just, like, ridiculous. Like, Henri is just the best player I've seen in the Premier League. Like, he's just ridiculous. For me, he's the best player in, in ever to play in the Premier League. He was, like, literally just insane. I feel sorry for Lingard. Gonna play good for West Ham United. Uh, gonna take him back and bench him. I don't think so. I don't think so. Hey, football fan 9 0, what's going on? <laughs> Hashtag come on you. Hey, what's going on, football fan? That sounds like classic EA. Yeah, it's something EA would do, isn't it? Anyway, Gardy, uh, I'm going to get some uh, sleep. Got work at 8 a.m., so I've got to get my beauty sleep in. Hey, see you later, Sam. 
Uh, thank you for the dono, man. Much appreciated. Have a good sleep. I'll see you tomorrow. Phil Jones and Maguire is the best ever duo in the history of football. I would have to agree. Burkamp Newcastle flick turn goal was so good. <clears throat> that was a classy goal, yeah. I feel like the goal is a little bit overrated, but it is a classy goal. <clears throat> and again, not to say that I don't mean overrated as in it's bad. I just mean it's it's spoken about a lot and it's a, f it's a great goal. But it's talked about as like the greatest Premier League goal of all time and I just don't agree with that. What have I missed? Um, I don't... The chat... I think the chat today has been really, really good. I don't know how everybody else feels, but I feel like we've had a good talk today. In terms of the career mode, you haven't missed much. Giroud's scorpion kick was uh, sick too. You know, I mean, this is going to sound really, really biased. I actually prefer Mkhitaryan's. I actually think Mkhitaryan's is better. But the build-up play and the team part of Giroud's goal, I think is nicer. But the actual finish from Mkhitaryan, I think is better. Or I should say, it's more difficult. Mkhitaryan was offside. Jazeel, the goal counted. VAR would have ruled it out. <laughs> and well, we got to take, we got to go back and take away a lot of goals then, Jazeel. But let history show that the goal counted. So it is a goal. Sorry, I had to leave on all my accounts. I'm going trust. <laughs> the bass on the background music is mad with a headset on. Nice. Uh, Mkhitaryan is pretty underrated though. Giroud overrated AF. I don't think Giroud is overrated. I actually thought for a lot of his career is underrated. Hey, Sanchi P. What's going on, dude? Long time no see. Yeah, I know, man. Good to see you. Yeah, I don't agree that Giroud is overrated. I think at best he's properly rated, but I think a lot of people still underrate him. <laughs> Mateo. Jazeel, because he played at Man United, they wouldn't have ruled it out. <clears throat> Man, I could taste the salt from here. So does that mean that we can count it as a goal so you guys can stop saying he was offside because even VAR wouldn't have picked it up? Is that what we're saying? So we are counting it as a goal. Okay, cool. Because it's a better goal than um than Giroud. It's a better it's a harder finish than Giroud's. Alright, let's get Pulisic back in this. I hate when they don't let you do it before the game, but they let you do it. They don't let you do it while you're loading up the game, but they let you do it before the game. It doesn't make any sense. Like, now I can start him, but if I tried putting him on from this menu, it wouldn't have let me. It's so stupid. Sorry, Cesar, you're going to have to play another game. Cesar getting really worked into the ground. Giroud is never overrated. People, uh, he's never overrated. No people overrate him. I've never heard anybody overrate Giroud ever. If you played at another club, it wouldn't have counted. Okay, Mateo. Did the goal count? Yes. Is it a goal? Yes. That's the only thing I'm concerned with. If the goal counted, it's a goal. Diego Maradona's handball is a goal. Regardless of it being a handball, it's a goal. Yo, Adam Mitchell, what's going on? Oliver James, what's going on? Oliver James hates Chelsea. 
I don't blame you. Um, Adam Mitchell says, remember me? Mm, no, actually, not really, to be honest with you. I usually remember most people. Yeah, Jazeel, see, I agree with you on that. Giroud's is a better team goal. I actually agree with that. And if you want to say it's the better goal because of that, I don't have any problems with that. I think if you're just looking at the one Scorpion kick versus the other, I think Mkhitaryan's is a harder finish. Whether that makes it a better goal for you, up to you. For me, it makes it a better goal because the finish is so much harder than Giroud's. They're both, they're both outrageous. They're both ridiculous. Yo, Alfie, what's going on, man? Adam Mitchell says, you said that last time. It was about one week ago. Your shit. I don't know if you're still here, Adam. But one, sorry for not remembering uh, your name. And two, you used the wrong your. I would appreciate if you used the right your. Which is, it's you are shit. So it's you, you with the apostrophe, R-E. Hmm. Jazeel, I agree. Arsenal have some of the best team goals of all time. They they score some absolutely ridiculous team goals. Especially during the Wenger years, man. Holy shit, like their, their passing sometimes was... Their one-touch passing sometimes was ridiculous. The Ramsey goal? Yeah, seriously. That, like, that's Like, that is a ridiculous goal. Ozil played a big part in many of them. I agree, yeah. Hi, by the way. I'm Alfie's web... Alt, but has the same name. They flick the flick against uh, Fulham, I think. Yeah. Er, but I agree with Matteo. Özil was a big part of uh, of a lot of those goals as well. The only thing uh, Arsenal have is a gold prem trophy. You reckon? Wilshire versus Norwich. There's another one. Uh, hi, Gardy. What's going on? Apex for one. Losing to United here, by the way. I might jump in. Oh, what? I have to substitute my injured player? He's not injured again, is he? That's a joke, right? That's just because he's coming back from an injury, right? Oh, wow. I took it out. Am I dumb? Oh, he gave it straight to me. Is he dumb? Woot! How did he get out muscled? I mean, it is Maguire. He's a pretty big boy, but still. Woot doesn't get out, out muscled. Greenwood, look at the pace. Come on, Christensen. No! I really messed it up this time, boys. I've really messed it up this time, haven't I? Oh. No. Um, what's going on, Ramsey Loves? L2. Ramsey Loves L2. Please explain the name. If you can. Give me that. Oh, my gosh. Ward Prowse doing his absolute best. Jimmy. Jimmy Ward Prowse doing his absolute best best to win us the ball back, but he couldn't. He's only a wee five foot five man. I don't know how small is Ward Prowse. He's pretty short, isn't he? Have a look at him. Little magician. Go. Someone make a run. Someone... How is McTominay catching up to Ward Prowse? McTominay is slower than a freaking snail. The dude should have like 20 pace. He's so slow. Gangly and slow. 
Oh, good stuff, Hudson Odoi. Go. There we go. Some urgency. Woot. Oh, what? Oh, Mike. Oh, Lindelof, what? How did he read that? So perfectly. I call bullshit on that. How did he read it that well? Piss off, Marcus. P Get out. No. No, 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 no. There we go. Yes. Oh, what a ball. Come on, Callum. What a name. Callum. Go on, son. Uh-oh. I don't know what I'm doing here. No. I messed it up. Woot. Oh, I messed that up big time. That should have been a goal. No cap. That should have been a goal. I messed that up. That's on me, though. I was indecisive. Usually, I know what I'm doing when I do, like, when I counter like that. Usually, I know what my move is. I didn't know what I was doing there. I made it up on the spot, and you could tell, because it sucked. Wow, that sucks. Hey, what's going on here? Mateo got timed out. Let Marius Cohen shoot? Unbelievable. I've got Ollie consoling me. Shit. Shit. Got dominated. Um, I don't know why Mateo got timed out. Stop begging me to. I know your weakness. 19, actually. Hey, Brent! What's going on, my man? I was actually... I needed you before. What's going on, dude? I was looking at some uh, youth players and stuff, and I was like, usually Brent is here telling me what to do. Third round of the FA Cup. You didn't have time... Uh, you didn't have to time him out for banter. So who's timed him out? Jamie, and then he said, F off Fredbo, don't ever call me weak. I don't get it. United were goaded in that game. Yeah, I don't mind losing to United, but that kind of sucks. Um, I don't get this. Wait, why has he been timed out? You only have one normal Prem trophy. Jamie STFU. CD scored 2-1. Mares, what's going on, Brent? How are you, man? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. How are you doing? How are you? Raf is in the chat. What's going on, Raf? Obviously, James Long. Guardy, uh, who are you thinking for Monday night, bro? Brighton or Pal? Wait, has it censored Palace? Or did you specifically type it like that? I'm confused. Um, stop scraping outside, little. Wait, what? Uh, Jamie, uh, but that is not worthy of a timeout. Yeah, I don't. I still don't. He supports shit Arsenal anyway. I still don't understand why he's being timed out, Jamie. I still don't understand why he's being timed out. Um, you're a Palace fan. Yeah, why did it censor Palace, though? Or did you censor it? I don't know. Anyway, um... Brighton or Palace? I'll go Palace. Especially because you're a Palace fan and I don't want to upset you. I'll say Palace 2-1. 2-1 is the easiest thing to predict. I censored it? I see. Oh, right. James asked me. But Ramsey is a Palace fan. Yeah, I think 2-1 or even 2-2. I'm a Brighton fan, and we will smash them, says James Long. Six unbeaten. All right, then. Um, let's go. Okay, we got one Brighton fan and one Palace fan in here. Let's say 2-2 two, two draw. Uh, Jazeel, I can't be asked shouting at him like I did uh, to you, Jazeel. So don't... Wait, what? You don't have to shout at him. But why'd you time him out? I'm still confused. 
I still don't actually know what like what the reason is, so I don't know if uh, Jamie's just done it because he felt like it or... Uh, Jamie, it's called banter and you can ignore. Just ignore. Don't look at the chat. Yeah, I mean, it just looked like banter. He was just saying that Liverpool only have... um. Because Jamie said that the only thing Arsenal have is a gold prem trophy. Then Mateo says, Jamie, STFU, you only have one normal prem trophy. Um, anyway, what is this? I don't know what this is, football fan. Not gonna lie. I have no idea. Brighton is shit, says Ramsey. Woo! Ramsey bringing the fire! Jesus. What is James Long gonna say in, in response to that? We got another match for our, um, boxing, uh, thing. It's, uh, it's Ramsey and James Long. Raf says bye. Say that to Raf. Uh, it will only be five minutes. It's over now. Yeah, but Jamie, that's still pretty unfair. That's still pretty unfair. Someone that gets timed out five minutes, someone that gets timed out for doing nothing wrong, he might not want to come back to the stream. Mateo says, Jamie TF, you're being so toxic for you literally started it. That is true as well, Jamie. You're the one that said that they only have a gold trophy. Like, you're the one that actually started the banter. Like, you can't, you can't dish out... If you, if you can't take it, Jamie, like, if you can't take banter, then don't start banter. That's all I'm going to say. If, if you can't handle banter against Liverpool, then don't banter other clubs. It's that simple. Uh, I'm joking. I'm a Wolves fan. And Brighton is so shit. <laughs> <laughs> so you being a fan of Wolves instead of Palace doesn't change the fact that Brighton is shit, hey Ramsey? Teku says, just came back and Jamie's arguing. And Bren says, beef is on here, getting fiery. Yes, I agree. It's getting, uh, it's getting smoky. Alright, semi-final EFL Cup against Arsenal. Their only good player for Brighton is none. <laughs> Damn, Ramsey, you really don't like Brighton. You you really have it in for Brighton. What did they ever do to you? That's what I want to know. Someone from Brighton has hurt you. For you to be speaking this ill of them. Brighton a shit though, says Alfie. <laughs> Why are we picking on Brighton? Why, where does this come from? Trossard is good. They're gay, are you sure? Like the the whole club or you mean the city? And if the whole city if it's the whole city, I got a question. How do they have kids? like how do they have kids? How are they reproducing in Brighton if they're all gay? Anyway, bye chat, bye guardy, see you later, Jazil. That's my question. More pay is kinda good. Um, yo bro, how you doing? What's going on? Scotland rules ASMR. Good to see you again, man. I'm doing well. How are you? Nobody likes seagulls? That is true, actually. You know what I hate when you're just like sitting at a public area and someone starts feeding the seagulls? Listen. Jenny. Stop. You and your two kids. Stop feeding the fucking seagulls. You idiots. Don't you realize they're gonna come and just literally beg you for more and more? They don't leave you alone once they know where the food is. Are you stupid? You ruined everyone's freaking day out. Because there's seagulls everywhere now. Uh, what did you need for the academy? Nothing. I was just looking at some players. I was looking at development. Um, seagulls are great. They look cool. No, they don't. They look like garbage. Man United are so dog shit. Hey, 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 hey. Ramsey, hey. We may be dog shit, but that doesn't mean you can say we're dog shit. All right? Simple as that. 
don't state the obvious. We all know that we're dog shit. Alright? But don't go there. Um... Then you need to see someone is feeding- Wait, then you see someone is feeding the seagulls and say, Can you not? They turn around and it's Goldbridge and his kids. Imagine what he'll say to you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Ramsey, I know it's banter. It's all good, dude. <laughs> Brent. <laughs> Imagine it's Goldbridge. <laughs> what did you say, you prat? I think we'll play this second half here. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my gosh. And <laughs> imagine you were imagine you're wearing a Burnley kit. It's bloody Burnley again! <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> Where did that come from? Um, we're all picking on Brighton, but Barca are also shit as Brighton. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I can write now Brighton. <laughs> oh, I just saw Ramsey's comment. Imagine being Mark Goldbridge's girlfriend. <laughs> Imagine being his wife. Imagine actually being Michael Bridges' wife. <laughs> Dude, that must be ridiculous. Like, <laughs> you roll around in bed and you just see Michael Bridges. <laughs> Dude, what the hell? Why is this so funny? <laughs> I'm crying. I'm literally crying of laughter. Fuck. Alright. Jimmy. Jimmy! Oh. I gotta regroup after that. <laughs> Yo, let's raid Mark Goldbridge. Dude, if we raided Mark Goldbridge, he would not know. He would, ne he would definitely not know. And I don't think he'd care either. Like, if you were at his level and someone was, like, raiding you, you wouldn't be like, oh, thanks for the raid. You'd be like, bro, I don't know who you are. Also, I just felt something on my head, I swear. Bloody Burnley! Yeah, imagine you had... Imagine you had that... I thought, like, maybe the roof was leaking or something. I, f like, felt something on my head. Um... Yeah, if you had, like, 9,000, 10,000 live viewers, first of all, you would not notice that in the chat. And second of all, like, if, so if you did somehow notice that you were being raided, like, you genuinely just wouldn't care. In fact, Goldbridge should be raiding other people. Imagine how much love he could spread with that raid. Imagine how much support he could spread. Like, how many viewers he could spread. <laughs> does Mark Albridge even know what raiding is? Yeah, he does. I'll tell you how he does. Because when he's doing his live match reaction, he always says, let's go raid Flex and uh, KG's post-match show. Like, I know it's on the same channel, but he still says, let's go raid them. Like, he knows what a raid is. Good work, Kante. Come on. Come on, boys. We don't, we don't want to lose to Arsenal here. I'm not going to lie. It's not that great playing with this team. Like, I, I'm not fluid with this team at all. I feel like me and this Chelsea team just don't click. That was a good laugh, though. Oof. That was a good laugh. I'll catch up on the chat after the game. It was a good laugh, though. Fuck, Goldbridge. Always makes me laugh, Goldbridge. Just the thought of him. Like, I can't believe he exists. Like, I, I cannot believe he's real. I've actually spoken to him before on a live show. Like, he's actually a really nice guy, too, by the way. Go! Does Mark Goldbridge... Oh, I really read that one. Hi, Guardy. How are you? What's going on, Jay Mayhew? Good to see you. Uh, poor mother. Why is this stream so quiet? 14 viewers. Oh, Mateo, since I took my break, it's just been quiet since then. I thought you meant, like, the, the audio levels were quiet. I was like, what? Surely not. Imagine being Harry Maguire parents. You're knocked down in one second. Yeah, but Mateo, I, um... Since since I took my two-week break, it's been very quiet, so... Actually, I kind of like it, though. It's not that bad. 
Gotta love the laughs. Yeah, slabhead. There's no more drama. Legit, we started talking about Goldbridge and nobody hates each other anymore. PXG Pop says, Guardy, you don't click with a team because you're shit at FIFA. Oh my gosh, please. Did you see that goal? I'm not here for the actual stream, but I'm here for the bants, says Alfie Webb. That's what it's all about. It's all about the bants. That's great banter. It really is. Bang. Go see it. <laughs> nice. Good overlapping run by Reese. No, I wanted to chipped into Mason Mount. No. Gadi, uh, what match comes in your mind when you hear the word remontada? Why do you guys ask such specific questions? Bang, get it out. Boom. Would you ever do a QA? Uh, when I'm streaming, it basically is a QA, but with some action in the background, when you think about it. Like, realistically, like, this is literally just me answering questions while playing FIFA, isn't it? Like, you can ask me anything you want right now, I'll answer. And I'll answer honestly. If I remember. What are we doing? We need to make a substitution here. Um, you should do a Wolves career mode. I might do a Wolves career mode at some stage. Yeah, maybe. Let's bring on, uh, Bogdan says, bro, no answer. Oh, sorry. What match when it comes in your mind when you hear the word re remontada? Uh, Barcelona versus PSG. You're such a bludger, says Scotland Rules. Wow. Yeah, I actually am. Are you sitting or standing? Everybody asks me this. I am sitting. Uh, would you ever do a Q and- oh, I already read that one out. True. Are you- uh, I already read that one out. You're such a blood. Okay, I've read. I actually caught up. I could score loads of goals. Uh, easy. Yeah, but I'm shit at FIFA. You guys gotta remember. I'm literally bum at FIFA. I. You know what it is with me. I struggle to. I like. I kind of gotta learn how a team is, like the players and stuff. Like I was playing. I told you guys about my Nuremberg career mode, right? I was playing with that, and I was playing really good. Like. Got promoted, got a few, like... I won the Europa League a couple times, actually. Two times in a row, I won the Europa League. Um, but, um... But I was coming, like, 7th or 8th in the league. What difficulty do you play on? It's legendary. So, like, playing pretty well with the team. Considering it's freaking Nuremberg. Starting the second division. Then I moved to... I've moved to Lyon now. And, um, man, it's so hard to play with a Leon team because I just don't know the players as well as I knew the Nuremberg players. Just how it goes. Fuck, that should have been a goal. Oh, well, it's one. I'll take a one nil. It's a win's a win's a win, right? It's all about the W. <clears throat> the 6-1, right? Yeah, yeah, the 6-1. Uh, Barca PSG, yeah. You should do a Brighton career mode? I might do a Sheffield Wednesday career mode. What do we think about that? Uh, let me guess, you sign the best pre-contract players and then sim the seasons with Nuremberg? No. Actually, I was playing a lot of the games. And I did not sign pre-contracts, no. I signed a few free agents. Like, I signed, um, Lewandowski in the, like, third or fourth season was a free agent. Hummels in the fourth season was a free agent. <clears throat> so I signed them. But I wasn't I don't I don't do pre-contracts in career mode. Usually I don't. And if I do, I'll maybe do one of them. I just think they're too overpowered sometimes.
Uh, Guardi, one channel you need to check it for. Goldbridge memes is Skull Thuggery. Okay. I'll look it up right now. Skull Thuggery. You should do a career mode and only be able to sign people from one specific country. Oh, sorry, one Pacific country. I don't know if you meant that in the way that you really meant it. I don't know if you mean one specific or one Pacific. Should I really only do one Pacific country? Yo, 26k subs. Are you feeling lucky, Pratt? <laughs> Yo, he full does edits and stuff? Twenty six K subs in in six months. Not bad. Not bad. Not a bad shout. I think they generally like without looking at this season, only I think the Prem wouldn't be the same without them. Uh Sheffield Wednesday, I'm a Sheffield Wednesday fan. Guardi on YouTube I already looked it up. Uh I think they are a good team with an existing history, says Mateo. City Rap 3-1. I just scored a 90th plus three minutes. Wow. I really thought you'd say Chelsea are shit because of Arsenal. Uh, one country only, says Ramsey. Yeah, we could do that, Ramsey. One country only. We could do that. It would be a little bit boring, though. Like, it would just turn into the national team, though. But I wouldn't mind doing, like, an Athletic Bilbao career mode where I can only sign, like, Spanish and French players. Or, like, Sp like people from Basque Country, but then the youth the youth system will be only Spanish and French, because that's the only two countries that can be... Actually, no, you can... I think now they've changed it where if it's your parents or grandparents were Basque, you can still play for Athletic Bilbao, I think. I hate Bill Bauer the passion. Why? Just randomly for no reason pick a team that in Europe that isn't Man United. Okay. Uh, Borussia much and Gladbach. So are you doing Sheffield Wednesday? I probably will do Sheffield Wednesday. Yeah. The the idea with Sheffield Wednesday is that I'll get the promotion. And get them into the Premier League. And then I just want to have a Sheffield Derby. That's why. Do a Stoke career mode? Probably not. I hate Bill Bauer with a passion. Yeah, but I don't know why, Bogdan. Nice. No Wolves. You know what I might do, actually? I'm going to get that Sheffield Wednesday thumbnail done right now. I'm going to I'm gonna ask the guy to do the thumbnail. Hey, man. Whoops, I pressed enter. Done. Um... No wolves. Uh, no, they did a 3 2 in the Super Cup final in the extra time. I'm back, says Hyper JJ. Wolves career mode? Do a Middlesbrough career mode. Middlesbrough would be nice as well. I'll do I'll do a couple of championship teams. Don't worry about it, guys. I'll do a couple of championship teams. Zero shots for both teams, 50 50%. Yeah, I know. This has been shocking. How is this even possible? You cannot go this long with no shots, right? Am I right? Sheffield United will uh, just get relegated in the first. Yeah, Jamie, that's what I'm scared about, that Sheffield United get relegated and we get promoted. Oh, well. It'll still be fun. Plus, it fits the kind of the blue theme that we've had with Chelsea. We'll do all the blue teams first. Uh, yo, sorry for being late. Tim, no need to apologize, my guy. We'll do all the blue teams first. How does that sound? The only FIFA YouTubers I watch besides Guardi FIFA... He's ultimate team YouTubers, really. Do Millwall? Nah, Millwall kind of bore me. Not gonna lie. What? I don't know why. Millwall just always, for me, just seemed so boring. 
The club just in general seems so boring. Like clubs like Millwall, Charlton. I don't know, just boring. And like no excitement at all. Hey, Havertz. Go! Birmingham City? I wouldn't mind doing Birmingham, yeah. Birmingham would be alright. I would do Birmingham. Don't do Bolton? Just don't. I also wouldn't mind doing Bolton, to be fair. Bolton, because in my days, Bolton was a Premier League team, so it's kind of sad to see them now, like, where they are. Alright, 1-0 win. I'll take it. Haaland got two goals, one assist, and Sancho got an assist. Could this be the turning point for Man United to get one of them? Probably not, right? Our board is that incompetent. Probably not. <clears throat> see you later, Ramsey. See you later, dude. Hopefully I see you in the future. Hey, Charlie, what's going on? I've been streaming for 111 minutes. Is that true? Is that actually facts? So later, Mateo. I'll see you tomorrow, dude. Uh, do Nottingham Forest because they have won the Champions League and I think they are in the Championship. Actually, you know what? I kind of want to do Nottingham Forest more. Ooh, I kind of want to do Nottingham Forest now. Shit, what do we think? Sheffield Wednesday or Nottingham Forest, guys? What are we thinking? Sheffield Wednesday or Nottingham Forest? What do we think? Best combo, Mark Goldbridge and Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Holy shit. Brent, I reckon that would be insane. Round three, replay? I don't like this. Nottingham Forest, Nottingham, Middlesbrough. Middlesbrough was not an option. Sheffield Wednesday because they have uh, today is Wednesday. Actually, yeah, that's true. Today is Wednesday. Today really is Wednesday, you're right. Um... Okay, we'll do we'll do Sheffield Wednesday first, and we'll do Nottingham after that. How about that? Okay, we agree. And then. 100% are we all in agreement that uh, the Nottingham Forest career mode Mark Goldbridge will be the manager are we all good with that I might actually get Mark on the thumbnail for Nottingham without his permission obviously because I don't talk to him what do we think I wish I could get his permission but I don't speak to Mark Goldbridge like that in fact, like anything, I don't speak to Mark Goldbridge, so. Goldbridge as the manager? I'm going to get Goldbridge on the, on the thumbnail for Nottingham. So now, does that change everybody's decision? Do we want to do Sheffield Wednesday or Nottingham still? <laughs> now that now that I've said that I want to have him on the, on the thumbnail, <laughs> do we want to do Nottingham Forest or Sheffield now? Still Sheffield Wednesday? Who's my favorite player at the moment? Probably... Are we finished the vid? Yeah, this will be the end of the stream. I'm working from home. I've, I've just clocked in, so... Sheffield Wednesday because today is Wednesday. Okay, we'll still do Sheffield Wednesday. 
but Nottingham Forest straight after, right? Back to back to back English teams. That would be that would be insane. Back to back to back English teams. Actually, technically, you could argue that we've done Bradford, Arsenal with the Invincibles challenge. Um, Spurs. We did an episode of Spurs. Chelsea. That's four. If we did Sheffield and Nottingham, we'd be doing six, six English teams in a row. Knots first. Gobridge's a secret forest fan. You do, I'm going to call it... I'm no joke. I'm going to title it Mark Goldbridge Nottingham Forest Career Mode. I may also look at getting Mark Goldbridge modded into FIFA and doing a My Player with him. Yo, I've got a lot of ideas now that we're talking about Mark Goldbridge. I don't know why. Hold on. I'm going to tell my thumbnail guy. Hold up. I got a better idea. Alright, we're gonna do that instead. We're gonna do... We're gonna do Nottingham Forest first with Goldbridge as the manager. When is the new Sheffield United agreement? We'll probably start it next week. We'll do Nottingham Forest. Do manager career mode, then a player, yeah. We're gonna do Nottingham... Mark Goldbridge's Nottingham Forest career mode. <laughs> we're gonna sign all the players that he hates. <laughs> we're gonna sign Fellaini. I don't know. We'll figure it out when we get there, right? And then... I'm going to talk to somebody about getting him modded in the game. That would be a... Can you imagine that video? That would be a banging video. To have Mark Goldbridge in FIFA. I got to talk to someone about that. Phil Jones incoming? Yeah. I got to talk to someone about that, boys. In the meantime, I have to go to work. So today was a very fun stream, boys. Good laughs. Good banter. I really love today's stream. I'll be back tomorrow for more Chelsea. We're at 22 games in. I think we'll wrap up the season by the end of the week. So we'll be we'll be ready for a brand new career mode next week, which is great. It's going to be Mark Goldbridge's Nottingham Forest career mode. And um, I'm going to speak to someone about getting Goldbridge modded in FIFA. So yeah. Enjoy the rest of your night, guys. I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you for the support as always. I love you guys very much. Stay safe and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Bye, Alfie. Bye, Derek. Bye, Light Helix, Brent, Jamie. Of course, we had uh, Mateo in here before. We had a lot of people in here, actually. Tim Games came in late, but he was here. Uh, Ramsey was here, of course. Uh, so was uh, Diamond Boy was actually in here before. PXG Pops was in here before. Uh, Scotland Rules ASMR, Bogdan. Michael was in here before. Thank you, everybody, for the support. Luke is in here. Luca is in here right now. William Morton. Oh my goodness. Hi, William. I'm leaving. Um, all right, everyone. Bye. 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 See you all tomorrow. Bye.